All right, so this is the opening and review of the world's rarest coffee called Black Ivory Coffee. It's made from elephant shit. So here's on the back right here. 10 years in the making, Black Ivory Coffee is the rarest and most unique coffee in the world. Naturally refined by elephants, AKA elephants eat the beans and shit them out. Black ivory coffee beans are broken down by the elephants, basically through their digestive system, resulting in a smooth tasting coffee without bitterness. Uh, blah, 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 as you can see. And that's the rest of it. So, sincerely, Blake Dinking, Dinky, founder. He walked up to an elephant shit and ate it. So, there you go. See how it tastes? It smells a little pungent like it's been in an elephant's ass. Vintage black ivory coffee. Originally made from elephant shit or out of an elephant's ass. So, here it is. You guys can pause this video and read all about it right here or go to the website, blackivorycoffee.com and see what we're doing. Um, naturally refined by elephants, meaning that it, elephants eat the coffee beans and then shit them out and it gives it a uh, unique flavor. So with all that said, here we go. It has a very... Uh, Pungent smell like a mix between earthy and something out of an elephant's ass. It smells pretty good actually. Not the elephant's ass part, but the coffee. So here it is. And also, also it uh, is. It's also another thing that this coffee, just this little pack right here was how much? $85. $85 right here. Just for this little pack of coffee. All you see right here, inside here is $85. It's basically one serving. One, one damn cup of coffee. Crazy, crazy. So here we are, we're gonna grind it up. And try it out. First time trying black iron coffee. So there we go. Right. Sure, where are the grindings? Wow. Ah, freshly ground black ivory elephants ass cough elephant shit coffee. Yeah, so anyways guys, they extract the shit. You better clap every little bit of piece of grinding granule off there inside of there. Well, you don't have the right grinder. Whole shit. Tap all that crap off. Fucking like five cents per kernel. All right, there you go. Um, so yeah, they extract the beans out of the elephant shit. And I guess what happens is it encapsulates the shit encapsulates, capsulate, whatever, however I'm saying that. Encapsulates, you know the word I'm looking for. Encapsulate. Encapsulate. The uh, beans and it gives it a good unique flavor. So. There it is, and it smells, once again, it's got a, uh, no bullshit, you can almost smell like feces, like an elephant shit. Let's see, Hold on. First, first smell test, here we go. Yeah, it kind of smells like it's been in, <laughs> I'm not joking, kind of smell like it's been in an elephant's ass. Dave, what does it smell like? I don't know, like a mix of coffee and... Nature or something. <laughs> <laughs> AKA elephant shit. Yeah. Well, next up, we'll see how it tastes. So here's the second part of the video. Um, what happens to this process? This is the grounds in the French press. And then what we gotta do is slowly pour the hot boiling water over the grounds and a step called the bloom, the bloom of the coffee, it actually like balloons up. 
that's where it's, I guess, taking in all the oxygen or whatever the hell it is. And then after that, you stir it up, pour a little bit more water on it, and then wait four minutes and then push the French press down, and then you should be good to go. Still can't distinguish this smell. Uh, part of your brain's telling you that you're smelling something that came out of an animal's ass. The other half of it smells like a nice, rich coffee bean. So, and no joke, it does smell. You have you smell a hint of shit. There's a hint of shit in the smell right here. I smell it. What are you gonna do with all this extra coffee? Yeah, put that in a Ziploc or some shit. I don't know. Better fuck put it in a Ziploc and put it back on e put it on eBay and sell it. I guess we can make another cup. Wonder what the after the uh, effects are gonna be after you drink this coffee. Uh, <laughs> good question. Uh, this is called what? The bloom, man. The bloom? Yeah. Hold on. This is called the bloom. Whatever the hell you're about to do. Huh. without a life proof case on it pouring hot boiling water <laughs> into elephant shit infused coffee you better not ruin this shit one shot 85 bucks you're supposed to be smelling this smell what the shit or the coffee the bloom man the bloom yeah it's not working don't tell me you fucked up 85 dollar cup of coffee it's good what do you mean it's good your freaking equipment sucks i can't pour it in what equipment sucks? This, I'm, I'm half-assing it here. Well, then go for it. Jesus Christ. <laughs> now it looks like diarrhea. <laughs> stir, where's your stir? Where's your spoon? Yeah. You, you just turned elephant shit coffee into diarrhea. I wonder what it smells like. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. That definitely smells like freaking diarrhea. Smell it. Can't do it. it. Smells like hot. Yeah. It smells like hot shit. <laughs> you drink this, I will give you 85 bucks. Oh my dear God. I'm not trying that shit. Literally. You got four minutes here. For what? I'm in the brew. It's brewing right now. It's brewing? Yep. Don't do that. Well, to be continued. All right. All right. Ready? Explain what this thing does. The French press. It just filters the grinds out. Bet you hundred. Bet you ninety percent of people don't know what the fuck a French press is. Oh really? Explain the damn French press, pompous bastard. Oh, look at my cup of coffee. I'm a fucking <laughs> queer, corporate queer. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, look at my 85 dollar coffee. <laughs> rich people are ridiculous. Fucking bunch of rich pricks. Who the fuck goes ahead and buys? You guys, before you preview this video, ma major vulgar language in here. So uh, put your kids in a room and something like that and come check the video out. Um, black ivory coffee from pompous rich bastards that drink this shit to blue collar workers trying it out for the first time. Here we go. Elephant shit coffee. Take one. Let's see what it smells like in its uh, final state. The, it smells like shit still. Cheers. <laughs> You gonna drink that piping hot? What's it taste like? That's fucking gross. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Oh, it's <laughs> sour and bitter. It tastes like tastes like the smell you were describing, like shit. <laughs> <laughs> Try it again. Mm. <laughs> Tyson, you want some? Me. You want some, buddy? I'm not. I'm probably gonna pass. Oh, really? Should I put some of this in it? Yeah. Okay, how are you drinking that freaking hot? Let's try it. Yeah, I don't like it either. I don't want to ruin it by putting this in it, though. Yeah, it's just like buying a friggin' Ferrari F430 and putting uh, Pep Boys seat, race seats in it. I guess the only way to mix this better is to dive into some Krispy Kreme donuts. Uh. <clears throat> Alright guys, hope you enjoyed this tutorial and uh, review of Black Ivory Coffee. The most rarest, richest coffee on earth. There it is. From Thailand. Is it really? Yeah. Black Ivory Coffee Company, LTD. Um, two Pacific Place, 17 out of 3, 142 Sakahamvit Road, Klonig, Thai, Bangkok, 10110, Thailand. BlackIvoryCoffee.com. Alright, so we just added half and half to this Black Ivory Coffee because it was so freaking what? Bitter? Yeah, bitter. All right, now a little uh, insight on this pompous prick right here, how he drinks his coffee. How do you drink your coffee and what does it do? This one? Yeah. Just put a tiny bit of half and half in it, smoothed it out. So there's no more bitterness to it. It's just smooth. So try it out.